y'all, what's up? My name is Avery and today I'm going to be talking about all of the books that I read in 2019. So behind me are all of the physical books that I read in 2019. Uh, this does not include the ebooks or the audiobooks that I read in 2019 and I read a bunch of those. <laughs> so this video is just going to be me telling all my Goodreads statistics and all that stuff and then the rest of the video is just going to be me listing off and showing y'all all of the 184 books that I read in 2019. I'm not going to be talking about my favorites in this video, that's going to be one of the next videos that I post, um, so stay tuned for my favorite books of 2019 video. But anyways, here are some statistics about my reading year of 2019. So yes, in total, I ended up reading 185 books. My total page count is 55,156 pages. <laughs> so I separated my books into four different categories. I read 40 physical books and then two physical books were DNFs. I DNFed more than two books in 2019, but these were the two physical ones that I read and remember that I did not finish. I did not finish plenty of ebooks, but for some reason I don't put that on my Goodreads that I didn't finish an ebook. I don't know why. Maybe that'll be a new goal of mine for 2020 to put that on my Goodreads also, but for some reason I don't have the ebooks I didn't finish on here. In total, I read 47 ebooks, which means that I read 95 audiobooks. Well, listened to 95 audiobooks. I took a gap year um, in 2019. I came home winter break 2018 and did not want to go back to the university that I was at. I was not having a good time. So I took a gap year basically. And so I ended up taking four community college classes at a campus that is a 45 minute commute away from me and I got a job as a nanny so I did a lot of driving around for both work and school so I got a lot of audiobook listening in I have never ever listened to this many audiobooks ever it is mainly because of my commuting I will say a goal for me for 2020 is to read more physical books I have a bunch of physical books behind me there is more than 40 books behind me I have physical copies of books that I listen to as well. I didn't necessarily read all of these physically, but I ended up reading them in some kind of format last year. So the longest book that I read in 2019 is Lover at Last by J.R. Ward at a whopping 608 pages. But I ended up listening to this book. This is, um, I believe, book number 10 maybe in the Black Dagger Brotherhood series. The shortest book that I read was Royally Raised by Emma Chase, which is 36 pages, which is a novella, a part of the Royally series, which is a series I completed this year and absolutely loved. The most popular book that I read this year was Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone by J.K. Rowling. I decided to reread the illustrated edition this year. This one is the most popular with 6,372,000 706 other readers. The least popular book that I read was Returning His Favor by Jacqueline Francis, which 31 people also read. My average rating for this year was 3.9 stars. I feel like I am very generous <laughs> in my star rating. I think I want to read more critically coming in to the new year, so maybe that'll be a new goal for me too. I'm not gonna make a goal video, by the way, because there's not gonna be enough for me to talk about, but um, I guess that could just be a little personal goal for me to stick to. The highest rated book on Goodreads that I read this year out of all the books was Saga Volume 9 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, which has an average rating of 4.56 stars. That's a great graphic novel series. That's a great book in the series. So I can totally understand why that one is the highest rated out of all of my books. Now that I've talked about my statistics, I am just going to be telling y'all about all of the books, listing them off that I read in 2019. I hope y'all enjoy. Guardian by Emmy Chandler, Ruthless King by Megan March, An Enchantment of Ravens by Margaret Rogerson, Defiant Queen by Megan March, Sinful Empire 
by Megan March, Royally Screwed by Emma Chase, My Oxford Year by Julia Whelan, Daughter of the Pirate King by Trisha Levenseller, Royally Matched by Emma Chase, Royally Endowed by Emma Chase, Royally Raised by Emma Chase, Beneath This Mask by Megan March, Free Fall by Tess Oliver, The English Roses by Madonna, The Highlander's Promise by Lindsay Sands, Savage Prince by Megan March, Iron Princess by Megan March, Rogue Royalty by Megan March, Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo, Furthermore by Tahara Mafi, A Nordic King by Karina Halley, Beneath This Ink by Megan March, Dirty Billionaire by Megan March, Real Good Man by Megan March, Real Good Love by Megan March, The Hating Game by Sally Thorne, The Vixen and the Vet by Katie Regnery, Emergency Contact by Mary H.K. Choi, A Quiet Kind of Thunder by Sarah Barnard, The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue by Mackenzie Lee, Dirty Pleasures by Megan March, Claimed by an Alien Warrior by Tiffany Roberts, Beneath These Chains by Megan March, Beneath These Scars by Megan March, Transcendence by Shay Savage, A Curse So Dark and Lonely by Bridget Kemmerer, The Prince and the Dressmaker by Jen Wang, Daughter of Smoke and Bone by Lainey Taylor, Loves by Shay Savage, Beneath These Shadows by Megan March, Beneath These Lies by Megan March, Beneath The Truth by Megan March, Dirty Together by Megan March, Take Me Back by Megan March, Birthday Girl by Penelope Douglas, Wait For You by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Be With Me by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Stay With Me by Jennifer L. Armentrout, the Ones Who Get Away by Ronnie Lauren, Fall With Me by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Veronica's Dragon by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Choice by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Redemption by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Lady by Ruby Dixon, Forever With You by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Fire In You by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Barbarian's Rescue by Ruby Dixon, Richer Than Sin by Megan March, Lauren's Barbarian by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Tease by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian Before Christmas by Ruby Dixon, Piper by Jay Asher and Jessica Freeberg, Barbarian's Beloved by Ruby Dixon, Paper Princess by Aaron Watt, Days of Blood and Starlight by Lainey Taylor, Willa's Beast by Ruby Dixon, Daughter of the Siren Queen by Trisha Levenseller, Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen, Guilty as Sin by Megan March, Night of Cake and Puppets by Lainey Taylor with illustrations by Jim DiBartolo, The Governess Game by Tessa Dare, Reveling in Sin by Megan March, Gail's Family by Ruby Dixon, Little Women by Louisa May Alcott, Angie's Gladiator by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Valentine by Ruby Dixon, Barbarian's Seduction by Ruby Dixon, A Girl Like Her by Talia Hibbert, Forever My Girl by Heidi McLaughlin, The Unhoneymooners by Christina Lauren, Broken Prince by Aaron Watt, Frigid by Jennifer L. Armentrout, Royally Yours by Emma Chase, Hannah's Hero by Ruby Dixon, Hate to Want You by Leisha Rye, All Your Perfects by Colleen Hoover, Suddenly You by Lisa Klepus, On the Island by Tracy Garvis Graves, Devi's Distraction by Ruby Dixon, Ice Planet Honeymoon, Georgie and Becky Doll by Ruby Dixon, The English Roses Too Good to Be True by Madonna, The Protector by Jody Ellen Malpass, Fire in His Blood by Ruby Dixon, Jake's Redemption by Jamie Schultz, Twisted Palace by Aaron Watt, Fire in His Kiss by Ruby Dixon, Fire in His Embrace by Ruby Dixon, Saga Volume 2 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Fire in His Fury by Ruby Dixon, Getting Schooled by Emma Chase, Saga Volume 3 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Saga Volume 4 by by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Getting Played by Emma Chase, Tarnished Crown by Aaron Watt, Hurts to Love You by Alicia Rye, Meet Cute by Helena Hunting, Dark Lover by J.R. Ward, Wrong to Need You by Alicia Rye, Lover Eternal by J.R. Ward, Saga Volume 5 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Lover Awakened by J.R. Ward, Saga Volume 6 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Lover Revealed by J.R. Ward, Saga Volume 7 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Saga Volume 8 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples, Saga Volume 9 by Brian K. Vaughn and Fiona Staples. Waiting for Tom Hanks by Carrie Winfrey. Big Rock by Lauren Blakely. Mr. O by Lauren Blakely. Lover Unbound by J.R. Ward. Nailed Down by Shell Bliss and Eden Butler. Well Hung by Lauren Blakely. The Year We Fell Down by Serena Bowen. Lover Enshrined by J.R. Ward. Queen Takes Nights by Jolie Sue 
Burkhart, Queen Takes King by Jolie Sue Burkhart, Fix Her Up by Tessa Bailey, Lover Avenged by J.R. Ward, The Wallflower Wager by Tessa Dare, Lover Mine by J.R. Ward, Vicious by L.J. Shen, Ruckus by L.J. Shen, Scandalous by L.J. Shen, Cold-Hearted Boss by R.S. Gray, Make Me Bad by R.S. Gray, Against the Rules by Laura Heffernan, Lover Unleashed by J.R. Ward, A Lesson in Thorns by Sierra Simone, Scoring Wilder by R.S. Gray, Lover Reborn by J.R. Ward, The Simple Wild by K.A. Tucker, Returning His Favor by Jacqueline Francis, Playing for Keeps by Kendall Ryan, Within These Walls by J.L. Berg, Beyond These Walls by J.L. Berg, Behind Closed Doors by J.L. Berg, The Gravity of Us by Brittany C. Cherry, Lover at Last by J.R. Ward, Neat by Candy Steiner, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone by J.K. Rowling, this was a reread for me. Ice Planet Honeymoon, Rahosh and Liz by Ruby Dixon. Before I Ever Met You by Karina Halley. Nadine's Champion by Ruby Dixon. The Swedish Prince by Karina Halley. The King by J.R. Ward. Trick by Natalia Jaster. Once Upon a Prince by Rachel Hauk. This was a DNF or did not finish. Ten Tiny Breaths by K.A. Tucker. Punk 57 by Penelope Douglas. Red, White, and Royal Blue by Casey McQuiston. Unfortunately, this was my other DNF or did not finish. The Shadows by J.R. Ward. One Ride by Chelsea Cameron. Linger by Maggie Steve Otter. This was a reread for me. The Hot One by Lauren Blakely. I actually also DNF'd this. Blood Kiss by J.R. Ward. It Takes Two to Tumble by Cat Sebastian, The Guppy Prince by C.W. Gray, The Beast by J.R. Ward, Blood Vow by J.R. Ward, Chase Me by Adia Ward, The Chosen by J.R. Ward, Callie's Catastrophe by Ruby Dixon, Well Met by Jen DeLuca, Blood Fury by J.R. Ward, The Wrath and the Dawn by Renee Audier, Watch Over Me by Mila Gray, The Chaos of Standing Still by Jessica Brody, Full Tilt by Emma Scott, Billionaire for Christmas by Lori Baxter, Penny's Protector by Ruby Dixon, Eleanor and Gray by Brittany C. Cherry, Pumpkinheads by Rainbow Rowell, and Faith Erin Hicks, How to Catch a Wild Viscount by Tessa Dare, and finally Monstrous Volume 1, Awakening by Majory Liu and Sana Takenda. So there you have it. Those are all of the books that I read in 2019. Let me know down below if you have read any of these books or if you plan to. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. I will see y'all soon in the next one. Bye!